L.R., the liberal redneck here, coming to you from a country whose leader is so desperate to remain in power, he is supporting the idea of a new civil war if he is successfully removed from office. That battle cry has been endorsed by his supporters at every level. The media arm of his campaign, otherwise known as Fuck News, warns of dire circumstances if he is impeached or fails to be re-elected in 2020. The so-called preachers, who lead his base of evangelical Christian racists, are, calling, are telling their parishioners that they may have to resort to armed insurrection to save the man they claim was sent by their God to support their beliefs. White nationalist paramilitary groups such as the resurgent KKK are already stockpiling weapons and ammunition in anticipation of a coup to keep the president in power indefinitely. Russia is once again inserting themselves into the U.S. election process to make sure their most valuable asset continues to hold power by any means necessary. The president won the election in the first place with almost universal support from the U.S. armed forces. He has since violated every promise he made them. The question is how will they react to the idea of brother fighting brother just to keep a lying sack of shit in office? Will they defend him or the country? The motivation behind this movement is his overwhelming commitment to racism in all its virulent forms. He has launched an all-out attack to turn our country back into the bastion of white Christian male supremacy that led to the original Civil War, or the War to Save Slavery. In spite of the surrender of the Confederates at Appomattox, the War to Save Slavery has never ended. Instead, it has reverted into a guerrilla operation that tries to intimidate people of color and all women into a submissive existence. The majority of Americans today are like those of 1861, and they find this situation intolerable. If the Trump racists want a war, then bring it. We fought against this crap once before and kicked its ass. We will not allow this divisive element to survive and stain our nation even further. Impeach. Vote blue. Save the United States of America. You can reach me at the liberal redneck at gmail.com and you can visit live with me, the pagan goddess, and the progressive Christian for our weekly wrap up every Friday at noon central on blogtalkradio.com forward slash the liberal redneck. Thanks for watching.